Handicapper Steve here, handicapping the racing from Kempton Park here on Tuesday night. It is October the 4th, 2016. We're going to look at race number 7, the 8.40 post time. Before I get on to that, remember to please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Get 5 for more selections. Today's 7th race from Kempton is a 32 red handicap. Class 4 uh, horse is going for a purse of $10,500. That's in American currency, so don't get confused. It's for 3-year-olds and upwards. We have a field of 9 horses traveling the 2,400 meters, a mile and a half on the all-weather surface. I believe it's poly track at Kempton. Um, you know, it's a very nice race here. Um, you know, I found a bit of a price here. Um, it's going to be the four-horse uh, Pasaka's boy. Um, I'm going to do a tri-cat here, or a trifecta, as, as the Americans call it. I'm going to go four, six, eight. Four, six, eight for the tri-cat, trifecta. Um, you know, something I noticed with... Uh, looking at the races from Kempton, you know, you always have a lot of prices coming in here. So you, I, when I look at Kempton, I always have to change my look, uh, my handicapping a little bit to, uh, to, to look at this because I can't normally, it, it's not the normal way I would handicap a race than looking at like a race for America or something like that. So I always have to change it a little bit for Kempton because it's, you can't, the horse on paper is not always the horse that's going to win. You know, you have to really look forward into it. But this horse, the four horse Pas Pasaka's boy, 8 to 1 here in the American odds. He's coming off a start at Newbury, September the 16th, uh, in a handicap class 4. This horse finished third by 7.5 lengths in a field of seven horses that day. You know, he couldn't get uh, a really good closing kick in the final furlong. You know, I think he should really do well with this added distance of the mile and a half. He's getting the extra two furlongs today. He gets that really long stretch here at Kempton, almost a three furlong straight away, which I think will be right up this horse's alley to close. Um, start before came at Espen, August 29th, a mile and a half, an amateur handicap class four, finished six by 13 lengths, carrying 157 pounds. Um, this horse just weakened. It wasn't a very good start for this horse, carrying 133 pounds today. Um, so the weight is the jockey's weight is going to really matter here. And start before he had a bit of a layoff um, from July. He, uh, start before came July 1st, stand down, mile and a quarter, class three handicap. He finished 10th by six lengths that day. You know, it just wasn't his day to win. Um, so um, you know, he's coming back today to this um, all-weather surface, which I think should really do well for this one. You know, he's been dropping down the class ladder slowly but surely. You know, I think he should really have a good run. He hasn't really shown... You know, he improved a little bit last time out at Newberry where going that mile and a quarter. He really... Like I said, he really wants to go the mile and a half distance what he's going to go today. Last time he ran it was that start at Espen, but he was carrying so much weight, he really didn't have a chance from the beginning. Um, and the start before that, he ran at Ascot uh, a mile and a half and a handicap class three, finished ninth by 13 lengths. You know, it was a very tough class for him to run. He's dropped down to the class four today. I think this horse should have a good run. And plus, that was the horse's first start at um, in about two years uh, that Ascot started in May. Start before came October the 11th at 24. So he did a long layoff. That was his last win, October 11th of 2014. Mount a quarter handicap at uh, Newmarket. He won by four and a half lengths. Easy victory. This uh, six-year-old gelding, I think he's a strong chance here at 8-1. So going to go with this one. So to recap my bets, race number seven from Kempton. Uh, it's the uh, 8.40 post time. Going to go with the four-horse Pasaka's boy. Going to go 4.68 in the tri-cat. 4.68. So good luck to all, and follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid 5 Good luck, everybody.